Hey guys, what is up? My name is Anthony, and today I'm going to be showing you how to record your iPhone or iPad screen. And I believe this also works for Android. So what you're going to do is um, to be able to perform this certain way of recording your phone screen or iOS screen, uh, you're going to have to have a Mac with QuickTime Player on it. So QuickTime Player, if you don't know what it looks like, I'll just show you. That's what the symbol looks like. I think you guys can see that. So, yeah, I'm not sure if this will work for PC uh, or other computers other than Mac. Uh, maybe if you have QuickTime Player on a PC, I'm not sure. But today I'm going to be showing you how to do this on a Mac. So what you're going to do is you're going to have your phone or your device that you want to um, record the screen off. And you're going to have to have a cable, like a charging cable like this. Um, you guys probably know what that is. Just a charging cable for your phone or device. And what you're going to do is plug it in. So let me just focus up here. Focus. Uh, you guys don't really need to see it anyway. So let me just plug this in quickly. So it's plugged in. So let me just quit all the programs so you guys can actually see what I'm doing. In the corner, focus that. You're going to see that quick time player is now on there. And now what you're going to do is, oh let me just, all oh, this crap keeps opening up. So what you're going to do is, um, if you're not on quick, player, quick time player, just search it up on your thing. And then in the corner, you're going to press file and do not click on screen recording. A lot of people get confused by this. Don't click on screen recording, you're, you're going to click on new movie recording, just there. Then this is going to come up, it's going to load a bit, and it's probably going to come up as the camera up here. But to fix that, what you're going to do is, you're going to go press down the drop down menu here, and you're going to go on your phone, and my phone is off right now. So as you can see, it's full screen, I'm just get a better angle. and. This is not laggy at all, so let me just focus that for you guys. Um, this this way, or this method of recording your iPhone screen is not laggy at all. I've used a, um, quite a lot of different like softwares that you download from the internet on your phone, and they're just really, really laggy, but this is a really, really good way. It's nice and simple as well, so if you do have a Mac, you have a really easy way of recording your phone screen. So this is basically good for you know, people that maybe play games on their phones or, you know, want to do tutorials on the phone. And yeah, it's a very simple way. It's also free because QuickTime Player is already on your computer. So to press record, you just press the recording button here. And it's recording. So as you can see, it's really smooth. I'll hold my phone up and I'll show you how in sync this is. So I'm going to go to the right. It's very in sync. And it's very clear as well, so you guys might not be able to see this because the camera might be a bit blurry because the, the focusing, but it's really clear. So um, it's very simple, and you can also record. See, I've got a Blue Yeti mic. Um, you can also record your voice over the screen as well, or over the screen recording as well. So if I just go here, let me just get rid of all this. Um, Go back into QuickTime Player, and then go into New Movie Recording. It's very simple to record your voice as well, so what you're going to do is click the drop down menu again. Focus that, it's going to work. You guys can probably see that. Um, so what you're going to see here is quality, and then it's going to have the options high or medium. Then it's going to have microphone. So you can use the input microphone, or the internal microphone that's in your computer already. Or you can use another microphone that you've got connected to your computer. So it's pretty cool. You can also use your phone as a microphone. And yeah, it's pretty cool. So hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Um, you know, a few weeks ago, um, I was looking everywhere on how to, you know, record your screen because that's what a lot of people, you know, want to do these days. And yeah, a lot of people just don't know how to do it. So this is 
um, February, nearly March 2016, and you can still do this. It's a very good way of recording your screen, and if you have a PC, I'll try and look into it, and I'll probably leave a comment down below if I can find anything on it. Um, I'm not sure if you have quick, if you can get QuickTime Player on a PC and just record your screen from that, but I'm not sure. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. And guys, I actually forgot to say, on the end of this video, I'll add a bit of a screen recording uh, sample. I'll play like a game or whatever, and I'll show you a sample so you guys can see the quality. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.